Hi everyone, let's continue Power BI visualization. So first of all, we will use same data. Let me finish this. I'm just removing this and I will create again. I'm removing this and this background, how I have taken. Otherwise, this canvas color is white. So by default. And uh, first of all, let me open my data. We will go to home, right? I'm just, just, just showing you how I had created this curve this is my file is already attached how i had attached my file excel workbook and where it is put it and this is my data and i will open this data and after that you can see these are my two files three files and i will use only this file orders and uh, on the basis of which i would create this visualization so order and then i would load it and i have already loaded this file now you can see these are the components of this file order file so uh this one is the order file i'm just showing you components of order file all these are components of order file so we would like to create a this one is the chart you can see this is stack column chart. I want to create this. So this is here. And now what we have to do, simple on the X axis, like my, maybe we are creating this chart in between order date. Order date, we can take it on X axis. And uh, I don't want year on the basis of the year, no quarterly, only monthly basis I want and day also I am removing. Then the y-axis we will take, let's say, on the basis of sales. So I will put this data in the y-axis. So now you can see this chart is prepared. Now you can see uh, there is the visibility January, February, March, April and all these things till December, some of your sales. Now you can change this title also. You can change these colors also. And you can change right x axis title and y axis title also. So, I'm just giving you how you can change all those things. So, you will just um, select this, and here is x axis. So, now you can see you can change color and you can change font size also of the x axis. Let's say I want color, let's say rather than blue is already color let's say this color right and uh, this one is the green you can say all the month's name has been changed now it is green some other color we can take it uh, let's say we will take this color this color I won't be able to select this color let's say this color we can take it so now blue and now these are the names and font size also you can increase let's say i have increased font size and now January, February, March, April and all you can change. And sum of sales that is on the y-axis. So we will click here y-axis and transparency also you can increase and decrease transparency. Right. You can have maximum height and all these things. Sorry, this one is the maximum height. You can increase or decrease. Then we come to the this one is the title. And title is right. So here is you can change this title also and uh, after that we will go to y-axis and y-axis you can see this one is the uh, y-axis and now suppose you want to change title of this y-axis you can change and there is the title is here and now this is the sum of sales by this one is the sum of sales by month. This is the main title of this curve. So what we have to do, let's say we are changing this title and we will say sales by month. So I have put it sales by month. Font also, I want to increase sales by month and this one is the title is change. And let's say I want to change color of this title. I mean, color of this font. So, um, this one is the color. And uh, otherwise, we can take black. And uh, suppose we want to put it in the in the central. I mean, centrally, we want to locate this. So, we can do that sales by month. 
and uh, font size I can increase more. So sales by one, right? This is my right. So after this, what we can do? Uh, subtitle also you can give effects also you can give the uh, visual borders. Yes, I will give border. So borders would be what would be the border color? You can see there is no border now. So border color we can change and uh, border color is off. And now first we will on this border color. And suppose border color we want to give this dark blue color. That would not be visible, I think. So uh, what we have to do, we can take this one is the, um, here is we will press this. And after that, we can go there in general. And effects and under this effect, visual this one is the uh visual borders. So here is that is on visual borders now, and uh, this one is title is also here, and further is um, let me visual under this y axis also i want to change values title so i want to change this title and uh, when we will press here this title and title is uh, already visible and color of the title is also black and suppose you want to change yes sum of sales now it is there and you can increase this the size of this title sum of sales on the y axis you can see and this is the now you can change. Further is uh, title is and uh, yes, font size also you can change here. Uh, those are the values. Values font size here is we, this one is we are talking about. So 9. So I would like to increase this value size. Now you can see 60k, 40k, 20k. This, this size is also increasing. And uh, further is uh, I think through this you can uh, you can you can uh, draw this curve and how I had given this title. Let me explain you first. Let me delete this, remove this. Now I will show you. Here is this is the top of this. Suppose I would create later on when I would show you how you can create your dashboard. So here is text box. You will select here in the home text box and when you will select text box and you can write anything whatever is your dashboard title you want to give so let's say i'm giving global store global store let's say i'm giving dashboard so this is the title and now what we have to do here is we can increase its font size also now font size we will select this and font size we will increase now maybe that would be 36 right and uh, you can arrange this centralize and after that what you can do further is now you can reduce this size and this is the size and now you can write so that is the right so in that way you can give this title and right how you have select this canvas background you will go there view i will show you and there is when you have to select here in the drop down box there is a number of themes so you can select any theme guys okay? browse for themes here is you have to go there what because i am not taking from my this uh, computer system I will theme gallery and in the theme gallery also you can select a number of uh, this one is the themes and uh, further is suppose you don't want in from uh, these all the bars should be single color so what you have to do colorful bars because this is my theme and you can change these colors whatever the color you want right and suppose your canvas is white so these would be if you would select this so these bars would be multicolored bars 
and you can canvas color means that is the background of this color, this this um, background of this canvas so anything you can select and this is the now my background because i had selected this and uh, after this you can select this so again we will go back on the same thing right so i hope this video would be helpful to you and in the next video we are going to cover up how to create dashboard and uh, that would be helpful you can create your dashboard with the help of your data thank you so much keep watching stay tuned